Welcome to this lesson on similar triangles. In basic terms, similar triangles are triangles that have the same shape but are different sizes. The triangle could be rotated or reflected. In similar triangles, all corresponding angles are equal. The ratios of corresponding sides are also equal. 6 corresponds to 4, 12 corresponds to 8, and 15 corresponds to 10. Notice that all of the side lengths of the larger triangle are on the top of the fractions and all of the values for the smaller triangle are on the bottom of the fractions. When you divide these figures they all equal 1.5. This is called the scale factor. The larger triangle is one and a half times as big as the smaller triangle. Let's look at a few examples. Determine if the following triangles are similar. Two of the corresponding angles are equal. If the third angle is corresponding, then the triangles are similar. We know that all angles in a triangle sum to 180, so to find the missing angle we take 180 minus 62 minus 40, which is 78. The angles correspond, so the triangles are similar. Please note, knowing all the angles correspond without knowing anything about the side length ratios only proves that triangles are similar. This does not work for any other shape. For example, consider a square and a rectangle. Both have the same angles, but they are not similar. You must show that all angles correspond and all side ratios correspond for any other shape other than a triangle. Example 2. We are not given any of the angles, so we'll have to compare the side lengths. A prime B prime over AB is 22.6 divided 67.8, which equals 0 0.3 repeated. B prime C prime over BC is 33.0 divided 99.0, which is also 0 0.3 repeated. C prime A prime over CA is 30.0 divided 87.4 which equals 0 0.343. Because this ratio is not the same, the triangles are not similar. Similar triangles are often found in real life. Determine the distance across the lake. We know that these are similar triangles because of the parallel lines. Alternate interior angles are equal and opposite angles are equal. All three angles correspond, so the triangles are similar. To determine what scale factor was used in the triangles, we need to find a set of corresponding sides. In this style of diagram, the sides forming a continuous line are corresponding. This means that the scale factor can be found by taking 78 divided 26, which is 3. The two parallel lines are corresponding, so to find the distance across the lake, we would multiply 24 by the scale factor to get 72 feet. Thanks for watching this lesson on similar triangles.